So we may or may not just have gotten the last like leak or rumor for Scarlet and Violet. So if you head over to Riddler Q's Twitter, um, in this post right here, there is a response that says, Ku, what's the plus one? I'm still not sure. And Riddler Q responds and says, M related, but they haven't revealed it yet, which M most likely means movie. Movie related, but they haven't revealed it yet. Wish there's a new Pokemon movie upcoming, which I'm pretty sure was delayed for a while, which is why it's coming out so much later. So with that plus one, a lot of people are assuming that this means the next mythical Pokemon, another mythical Pokemon. So the second mythical Pokemon for Scarlet and Violet may be coming out upcoming with the next Pokemon movie, which would probably be announced in Pokemon Day 2024. So February 26, I think it was. I can't remember the exact date, but it's late February where Pokemon Day is happening and they're going to announce a brand new mainline game that was leaked. People are assuming they're going to announce a new movie alongside a brand new mythical Pokemon. So in the book in Scarlet and Violet, there's a picture of what looks like a gorilla or some type of monkey, which a lot of people think that could be the next mythical Pokemon. Although a lot of people do think it's slacking or slaking. I still don't know how to pronounce that Pokemon name, to be honest. I've never really used them or really cared, but a lot of people think that may be slacking but a lot of people think it's not. A lot of people are saying, no, it's really not, and this probably could be the next mythical Pokemon. The reason why this is just a debate is because it's the backside of the po of this Pokemon in the picture or the drawing. You know how like Game Freak is and everything, they like to kind of hint at things, like Pacharit was hinted as like a stuffed animal plush in the background of a shop, and a lot of people think that this will be the second mythical as well because Pacharit is for Kitakami, and then this would be for actual Paldea, like the actual Paldea region itself which is actually really interesting and truly does make sense. So it's like, because we see the backside of this Pokemon in this drawing, it's almost like they purposely do not want us to see it. And if you were curious about the plus one, um, somebody asked that and the other guy responded and said that Ku tweeted out seven plus eight plus one before we rationalized that to be all the brand new Pokemon they're adding post launch. Seven in the Teal Mask, eight in the Indigo Disc, and there's still one more Pokemon unaccounted for and it looks like it'll be revealed in tandem with M24. M24 meaning the 24th movie because there's currently 23 Pokemon movies. The next one will be the 24th one, which is crazy. There are so many that I have not watched. I don't think I've watched a Pokemon movie in a long time. It's been, I don't even know. I can't even tell you. I probably have only seen the first few. I definitely got to watch them again or just watch all of them in general. I definitely want to watch like the first one. Of course, I've seen the first one a lot. Gotta watch that one again, the second one. Anyways, we're going off on a tangent here. So that would be really, really interesting to see if this will actually be the next mythical Pokemon and if this will be another installation to Scarlet and Violet because a few months ago, I think it was Ruler Q that hinted or tweeted out that there's gonna be like four DLCs for Scarlet and Violet. So there's part one, the Teal Mask, part two, the Inigo Disc, part three, most likely being the Pacharunt event. And then part four, maybe it's going to be this next mythical Pokemon that's actually based in Paldea. I think it would also make sense too with the gorilla monkey style because it kind of matches Ogre Pond and I feel like it matches the overall style of like the legendary Pokemon that we have had with the whole Scarlet and Violet Generation 9 games. So this is going to be really interesting to find out. Pokemon Day is coming in just about a month, probably exactly a month. Pretty sure, like I said, February 26th, I believe, and where they're going to announce a lot of new things upcoming for Pokemon. Hopefully, they announce some good stuff. I'm really hoping for some type of Generation 5 game. I don't know. What do you guys think they're going to announce? A lot of people either say Johto game or black and white style game. Probably not remakes. I don't think it's going to be any remake, but it seems like we're most likely going to get a brand new mainline game announced. So, hope you guys enjoyed this quick video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.